Hey everyone, Steve F. here after a little bit of an absence. Um, as I think most of you know, our daughter Ella is here from Italy with her three young kids, age nine, seven, and five. So it's pretty hectic around these parts and not a lot of time to record jokes if you kind of catch my drift. But they're out at a swimming pool right now, so, you know, I've got like... 15 minutes alone or whatever so before they come back we're going to record a joke so this is an oldie but a goodie uh, you may have heard this one before but I, I hope you like it so there's this man at the super bowl he's sitting on the 40 yard line he's got great tickets great seats and he's sitting there and the seat next to him is empty and uh, a couple seats away uh, another man leans over and says, excuse me, sir, I can't help but notice that, you know, we've, we've all got great seats around here and, you know, on the 40 yard line and we're nice and, and close to the field, but the seat next to you is, is empty. You know, I'm just curious as to why the seat next to you is empty. And then he goes, yeah, it's, uh, it's my wife's seat. He says, uh, she and I had a tradition for the last 40 years We'd always go to the Super Bowl. It was our thing. We, we did it together. We'd go to town and the night before have a nice dinner, kind of revel in all the uh, celebrations of the Super Bowl and get caught up in the atmosphere and go to the game. And it, it was our thing. We, we loved it. And um, she just passed away. And that would have been her seat. A little silence between the two men. The, the second man says, oh, says I'm, I'm very sorry for your for your loss it must be quite hard but geez it's a shame that uh, <clears throat> the ticket has gone to waste and the seat is empty i mean couldn't you have found someone a family member a friend S couldn't you have found somebody to to take the ticket and, and come with you to the game guy goes oh i i tried but i i couldn't get anyone to go they're all at the funeral <laughs> <laughs> they're all at the funeral so there you have it it's uh this week's joke uh, it was clean i'm sorry I'll, I'll try to be more off color next time but i figure the first one back we'll just kind of ease into it right we'll we'll build up to the off color jokes um weather has been really lousy here for the entire month of july the last couple of days have been nice so i've been moving mulch and you know doing outside work and that kind of stuff and the kids finally have a decent day to go to a pool, so they, they took advantage of that. I hope everyone's having a great summer. Um, things are turning around pretty much back to normal, which is great. I hope everyone's smiling and having a good day, and uh, we'll catch you soon. Take care.